Once upon a time, there was a beautiful car. It was called Fiat Cinquecento. And today, we will be talking about not only Fiat Cinquecento, but one of the most rarest and the purest Italian manufacturers ever built. One of them being this beautiful, insanely model. Look at it, it has curves like my mom. And it has beautiful Italian spaghetti inside of it. Starting from carbonara to penne arrabbiata to reef and beef in Vapiano. And today we are talking about 180 horsepower model Fiat 695 Tributo Ferrari. This model, there are only 500 pieces of this in the world. That's what I read on the internet. That's what I think it is. And that's how it is. So today you can see that this car, this beautiful car has an engine, four cylinder engine, turbocharged. It has 230 kilowatts and everything is beautiful. But why would we be talking about this shit model about this car when we can talk about the real one? The real pure Abarth, the purest of the pure. We have a beautiful sound of an airplane passing by smelling with a diesel engine. Today, we have the purest out of the purest engines. With this car, we can be, we can see that it's all Tributa Ferrari, you know, 695. We have the Quadrofolio uh, exhaust pipes stocked by Akrapovic, very nice. All of these intakes are very fake because we don't need them in these cars. But with this beauty inside of it, with the most beautiful engine and the most beautiful sound, purest out of all of them, we have the Ferrari. The Ferrari itself created this car with a beautiful engine, one of the purest ones, with an amazing sound system. It being a, one of the most rarest cars, we have the Abarth engine, four cylinder engine, turbocharged in line. It's very pure. Here we have the engine itself. You can cook the mama's pasta on it very nicely and very pure. It will be carbonara on this side, on this side we will have penne arrabbiata. Everything is completely by plan. Every day you can use this car as on a piazza de compono in Rome as a shopping bag. When you, want, when you go and buy uh, your wife a beautiful skirt from Gucci, that's what the car you can use. Or when you're late for mama's birthday, it's very nice with it. Or, of course, with a beautiful engine, we, we have a small trunk. So Italian Mafia cannot use this car to put a dead body in it. This car has a torque of 215 Newton meters. It has an inline, uh, inline four cylinder engine, turbocharged as I talked about. It has 180 horsepower and zero to 100 kilometers. It's probably caused by 6.9. Some people say 7.3. We, we will do the test, of course, on this video. Then now I would rather stop talking about the car and start talking about more in my channel. Today we're gonna be talking about them. Today we're gonna be talking about me. My name is Alexander Perich, and I, you are now on my channel, Aki's Garage. Every every Friday I'll be releasing a new episode involving new different cars. We'll be talking about cars. We'll be driving them, and we're trying to make this as more as fun as it could be. We're not trying to be serious about this. This is not the whole point of me telling you about the cars. You can read that online. You can read. Uh, you can watch Top Gear and uh, any of these. For me, it's the point to you, for you to feel the car with me, and the feeling with the car with me is something more important for me than actually talking about the car. Second of all, I personally loved the car since I was a kid. I was born. I was born into a car. I, I literally. I'm a car myself. Uh, I have an engine and. I'm running on it on a natural 95 from Shell, the best, the best gas station. I'm, I'm not promoting shit out of this right now. Um, also, my favorite car manufacturer is Ferrari. As you can see, Ferraris are the best cars in the world. They always made the best cars and the best everything. They have the more, most of the racing history that there could be. Secondly, I think that we should stop talking about me or the car. And I think that we should start driving it and feeling it.
So, as you all saw, this majestic Italian creature over here still holds the Italian majesty of sports car. It's still one of the best sports cars as it can be. It has the history of rally cars, a Barth itself, and it, is it worth 400, uh, for 47,000 US dollars? Well, it depends on what you need the car for. If you're trying to take a majestic piece as this, of course it's worth it. You will have a lot of fun with it. And especially, it's small, compatible, you can park it wherever you want. And the sound is one of the most amazing things that this car has. And that's what makes this car itself. And I think that with this, we can end the episode majestic.